My name is Chi and I'm one of the founders of Charge Blast. Today I'm going to show you how to enroll your Shopify store into Charge Blast for pre-dispute alerts. All you need to do for enrollment is find your billing descriptor and your Visa ARM code. So we'll start off by finding the billing descriptor. To find your billing descriptor in your Shopify store, all you have to do is go into the search bar and type in statement descriptor. When you do so, click on the first option that pops up and you'll see under customer billing statement, the statement name. So here, the statement descriptor is SP Mongol. What you have to do then is go into your Charge Blast dashboard, go into settings, enrollment status, and under MasterCard ethical alerts, you can enroll your billing descriptors. So in this case, you would want to enroll SP Mongol. Press the plus button and submit it. Then our team will have this enrolled within 24 hours. So you'll start seeing alerts from Ethica within 24 hours. Now to enroll in Visa RDR alerts, what you have to find is a few Visa ARN codes. To do this, we'll have to go into your orders and then you can filter in your order section under payment status, pull up all your refunded transactions. You'll have to look through some of these transactions to find a Visa refunded transaction, but I've already found one for the sake of this video. And you can see when you scroll down all the way to the timeline, you can find a acquirer reference number or Visa ARN code. In this case, it's 240113, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. All you have to do is copy that in, press Add Enrollment, copy in the ARN code, add it in, and then find three more ARN codes. Then you can press Submit, and our team will enroll you into RDR alerts, and this will take typically around uh, seven days or so. Now, what's nice about Charge Blast is that we're fully integrated with Shopify. So you can actually automate the whole process for matching alerts to transactions, refunding the transactions associated with the alerts, canceling subscriptions associated with the alerts, as well as blacklisting customers um, that are associated with the alerts. So to connect your Shopify account, all you'll need to do is go into the integrations tab click into Shopify here, you can add connection. And you can see here, you have to type in or copy in your store URL. Now I'm gonna show you how to do that. You can go into your Shopify store and then in the search bar, search domains. Click on the first option that pops up and you'll see here that the primary domain for my Shopify store is 062A3E. You can copy that prefix in, press add connection, paste it in here, and then you can connect your Shopify store. Now, in this case, the Shopify store is actually inactive, so we cannot connect it. But those are the steps in finding the Shopify store URL. And that's it. Once you've enrolled your billing descriptors for Ethic Alerts and your four Visa ARN codes for Visa RDR Alerts, and then integrate your Shopify account, we'll be able to start sending you pre-dispute alerts so you can catch these chargebacks before they hit your payment processor. And thus, you can keep your dispute rate basically near 0%. Again, by leveraging pre-dispute alerts, you can keep a healthy dispute rate and de-risk your payment processing account from being shut down. In addition, you'll see an increase in payment authorization rates, meaning over time, your payment processor, as well as the credit card companies generally, will allow you to accept more payments, anywhere between 1% to 5%, which is pure additional revenue, as these are customers that have tried to purchase on your shop before, but were blocked by either Shopify or the credit card company. So if you have any questions, 
with your Shopify store enrollment in ChargeBlast, please don't hesitate to reach out support at chargeblast.com. We're around 24 seven to help you in your enrollment process. Thank you very much. And thank you for your interest in ChargeBlast.